Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna talk about something that I bought for my trip. So I haven't been on vacation like, I don't know, I'd say like two, three months. Or I haven't even been anywhere other than literally like Kentucky. So I was planning a trip to Miami it's next weekend it's also my birthday coming up I have a trip planned I honestly probably need a new bag and I was like okay well I don't really like traveling with my pochette Maltese because it's kind of like big like it's a nice like crossbody bag but it's like kind of big and then I have the mini pochette but then that's like too small <laughs> And so then, and also like those bags are both like brown and I don't, I don't personally believe in, in matching brown and black. I know that's like an old fashion rule from like God knows when, but I'm a little OCD, a lot's OCD and I just can't do it. I really can't. Like, I mean, I do believe like if there's like brown and jeans, like, you know, how like blue jeans have like brown stitching or whatever with black shoes, like that's really fine. Like that's okay. But like. If I have like a brown dress, I would not be carrying like a black purse. Like, and then I would pull out my mini pochette or like my regular uh, pochette Maltese. So then I was like, okay, I need a black bag. And Louis Vuitton has like their leather um, black bags. But like, I really wasn't feeling any of them because I, I kind of wanted it to be like a wristlet kind of thing because, you know, once things start opening up and, you know, whatnot. I, and I'm fully vaccinated, obviously. I want to be able to go out and about and not have to like throw something over. Cause you know, sometimes like when you wear a crossbody bag, like because it cuts here, it kind of like ruins the flow of your outfit. So like you wear it on your shoulder, but then mine falls off my shoulder and it's really annoying. And if I'm drunk, it's really annoying. So I was like a little wristlet thing and, it, and I needed to fit my phone cause I have a 11 Pro Max. That's all I need. So I did a little bit of shopping and I got something from St. Laurent. Saint Laurent so um I already ripped off my package but I do uh I mean my address but I do appreciate when companies put on a bright sticker that says do not leave it at my door let me sign for it or in this case the FedEx may call me I said thank you sir that was very nice of you and so this is what it looks like um, this is all, well, this is an envelope, but this is all just like wrapping. So here's the box. And so in this thing, which I don't know who put this in here, but they did, <laughs> they shoved it in. So it just says St. Laurent, thank you. And then it has the return labels and how to return stuff if you were to return it. So nice envelope, cute. And then here's the box. It does have the ribbon on it. Okay. So here it is. And then it also does have the label on the inside of it. So it tells you this is the pouch monogram. Um, this uh has a bunch of like the care directions and then it has this black tissue paper and it does have like a little sticker stamp that says saint laurent in it again saint laurent it comes into this pouch that i think it does actually close yeah so it has a drawstring around it a little peeky peeky and i got Ooh, the YSL large build pouch. It has a little cover for that one, the little strap. So they technically do sell this pouch like without the wristlet. This, the pouch without the wristlet, I think it's like $4.25. And when you add a leather strap to it and a little hooky and a little clampy clamp, it makes it, I think $5.25, I think. Um which isn't bad i understand it's like it makes me feel better because at least louis vuitton things aren't even leather they're canvas for the most part and 
you would probably pay more for this if it wasn't a monogram. Actually, I think they did just come out with a like bill pouch. I think theirs is called like a slim wallet or a slim purse or slim something. And I think that one is about $500, but it is around that range anyways. And it's not even leather. I think like one side or like this back strip, but on their bag is leather, but it's pretty cute. I will say if I don't like using my little key pouch as a wallet anymore i will probably get that slim purse for my louis vuitton just because we gotta match brands we can't be switching stuff up um i don't even know if this would fit in my pocket i don't think it would but back to this that one i guess people use as a slim wallet because it's pretty slim but like for me obviously wanted one with a wristlet a wristlet um for drunk people reasons just you know grab on when i need it um so it is 100% leather. It's obviously in the black and I like how it's the textured one because if it was, I don't know if I could ever get a leather bag that's smooth leather because if you ever scratched it, I'd break my little heart. So basically it's just a leather strap, same material, a little clampy clamp. I guess you could take it off if you wanted to with the D-ring, um, a little leather hook thing. So the back has, let me take this out. It has four card holders, so one, two, three, four. And they just have this little piece of paper in there as a to visualize a card being in there. So they have four in the back. And then, I didn't realize this, but there's actually, these are pockets. I did not realize that when I bought it. I thought it was just the card holder and then this, and this was just like a design. So that's kind of nice to, I don't know, step something quick. Um, here is the zipper. It doesn't say, actually it does. It says St. Laurent Paris on it. It has a little blue protective tag. I haven't used it yet, so I'm going to keep it on. And the front obviously has a YSL for you, St. Laurent. Stiff the zipper, obviously, because it's new. Um, inside it has, I don't know if you can see, it has a serial code tag on this side. And then on this side, I think it just says, Saint Laurent Paris and you can see that because it's in silver and stitching um only thing in here is there's a little flat pocket but other than that this is just a big old pocket and then this is a little flat and obviously I'm recording on my phone and I'm gonna show you but my 11 Pro Max does fit in here and I am able to zip it now I don't know how much I'll be able to put in there so like I usually my keys are attached to my wallet, which is the Louis Vuitton key pouch. Um, when I do go out, um, <laughs> you know, with being a girl, you really don't need a full wallet. You don't really need that much money, depending on where you're at. You just need an ID and like, let's say you want some food, you know, it's cool. I, I'll bring my debit card. I'll bring 20 bucks. I'm straight. So, you know, I'll probably put my ID and my debit card back here. I haven't decided what I'm going to put back here. I might put my insurance card or something because when I travel, I don't play this. You need to bring your insurance card because, Lord, something happens to you. Take it out of them. Don't take it out of them. Build them. Build them. So, I'll probably put my ID and my insurance card because, you know, it is what it is. So, I'll probably do that. I don't know. I'm feeling stupid. I might stick a 20 in here. Probably won't. But then I was thinking maybe I'll put like, um, I don't know, a piece of gum, some receipts. I don't know. I don't know whatever I'm gonna put in there. Or I was thinking, so my phone also does fit in here, but it's like a, you know, it's not like a zipper of a enclosure. So I guess technically my phone would fit in here. Oh, I forgot, it is lined with like a, I forgot what it's called, microfiber liner on both these pockets. Okay, so honestly, my phone keeps stopping, so I don't even know what I said last. But basically, obviously put some cards back there. My phone does fit in this big zipper pocket, but I might fit it in here and just squeeze it in there. Um, if I need to put like important things, like I'll actually put probably a few set of keys, like just like my front door key and like, I don't know, cash and my debit card and like a lipstick, lip gloss, and probably a charger, a tampon, a pad, something like that. So I probably put that in there. And then the front, I don't know. It's probably gonna end up being random things probably, but 
if you guys want to see what fits or how I use it or anything else um it's on the website still it has a ton of colors um I will say most things on Louis Vuitton's website another reason why I didn't order off them all y'all in this damn stemmy check everybody went a little crazy as much as everybody is all into buying dupes right now real websites are actually sold out of shit and it's actually annoying so i needed this bag by this weekend or this upcoming weekend so why so was the deal um i think they sometimes come out with the silver version but i was okay with gold and there you go thanks for watching i hope you guys enjoy if you have any questions leave them down below and don't forget to like and subscribe i'll see you guys next time bye